if we're excited on the road with the trailer kind of see it in the back there it's pretty wide takes up a lot of room it's hard to see around you can see that in the rear view mirror there but that's why this backup camera really helps I mean you need it a little bit for just getting into your spot but what I really like about it is it it uh, shows you who's behind you and how far they are there because this trailer is pretty wide back there so it's a nice feature that they came up with for the Airstream and uh, you just have to plug it in and pair it. I'll show you how to do that. The camera's right on the back of the trailer and uh, that really, really makes it easier to drive. All right, here's how you sync up this wireless camera. So I turn the power on, just plug it in to your lighter there. It's got no signal. What you have to do is turn your lights all the way off. So if you got like an auto setting on your lights, which it normally is, turn the lights all the way off because the power to this thing when it synchronizes is coming from your running lights. So you just want to hit the select pair button here and it's going to say press and hold the pair button for five seconds then apply the power to the camera. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to go switch my lights on. And that will pair it up. So we're heading up to Young State Park. That's in Boyne City. It's a new one, never been there. It's at the end of Lake Charlevoix, the east end of it. And I uh, got some kayaks, taking the trailer, getting towards the end of summer here. So definitely looking forward to getting out and seeing what this campground is all about. We're still learning a lot about camping, trailer camping, how you do all this and uh, it's starting to get it down just being our first year here but you know it's been super fun so far and this one i think is is going to be a real nice one you know the trailer itself just loving it uh more than i thought i would i mean they're expensive for sure uh, you can buy a lot cheaper 16 foot trailer if you just wanted a trailer but for us it was about getting an airstream getting that kind of quality and look and, and functionality in, in a travel trailer. We're only going to do this once and you know one thing is for sure is we're not getting any younger so if not now you know when are you going to do it so that's the way we looked at it took the plunge and got the thing in this past spring.